What is going on guys? So today I got a video about booster packs, what they do, how to get them, and um, yeah, pretty much it. So I'm on the booster pack screen. I'll show you guys how to get here. But first, I just want to explain a few things. So um, a booster pack creator, basically you just create booster packs from extra community items in your inventory. So you can convert cards or backgrounds or things like that into gems and then you can use these gems to get a booster pack which will contain three trading cards from the game you select but certain games their booster packs will cost more as you can see csgo's uh, booster pack will cost more than battlefront 2's that's just probably because player base and maybe the trading cards are worth more stuff like that you know they're just that's just how it is um so different price per game so how do we get to this um, let's go to our inventory so just go to the top left hover over your steam uh, profile name and then click on inventory and here we are brought to our inventory click on steam on the top tab here and that'll bring you to your steam community inventory where you can convert things into gems so i have this battlefield one foil i'm going to convert this guy into gems yes convert it into gems okay i got 320 gems um and then i'm going to convert this also into gems yes okay now i have 400 gems and i think i can convert uh, yeah you know what this is fine turn this guy into gems too or how about yeah yeah all right turn into gems that's fine I have 440. Okay, so now I can click create a booster pack or pack gems into a stack. Doesn't matter. I'm going to click pack gems into a stack. Okay, anyways, that doesn't matter. I don't know if that feature fully works. Create booster pack. So now I can um, select a booster pack for one of the cheaper games. So I'm going to do Battlefront 2. Um, then I'm going to do make untradeable pack make pack and yes i only have 80 entries so some of them hold on so are you sure you want to spend 429 gems you only have 80 untradeable gems all oh, right because this is just because i just converted them into gems um you get a little bit of a cooldown before you can trade them on the community market but totally fine it still lets you make the pack so here we go um view my inventory I now have the booster pack here, and all I can do is just click unpack, um, or I could trade it later on, but you can't sell it on the community market anyways, so it says not marketable. Anyways, so I'm clicking unpack here. Here's the uh, animation, and here we go. So I got some trading cards here, and now I can just close this. We can take a look. I got my leftover gems here, and now, um, yeah, so I think they are from the same pack yes they are and are from the same um badge so i can buy the rest of these or i can play the game maybe get some more but yeah um now i can get a new badge so that's pretty cool um that's how you get a booster pack that's what they do hopefully that's enough of an explanation guys if you have any questions just leave a comment i'll reply to you um so yeah uh, hopefully you found this video helpful if you did please drop a like and don't forget to subscribe Thanks for watching, guys.